Well, hi everyone, it's Cindy. I hope you're all having a great week. I got something a little different today. It's not gonna be about um, beauty or you know skincare and hair care. It's gonna be about a short film that I did. So I'm gonna show you the film. It's about 15 minutes and it's a drama and it's, some of it's based on true story. The, um, the writer and the director, her name is Jay Ding, she's from China. And, we always, and she's also known as Christina. She went to the New York Film Academy in Burbank. She wrote it and directed it. She did a phenomenal job. Um, she's gonna be, a, she's gonna go a long way in her life and she's gonna do wonderful things. I do appreciate her giving me a chance to be the lead, giving me the chance to play the role of Aubrey, who is the mother. It's called The Mother. And I want to say exactly what her role is. I play, um, Helen is, is my daughter and Keith is my husband that I, it's in, that's in the film. And um, I'm about, I'm a woman who is, values her family. She loves her daughter very much and believes that the best protection for her daughter is to keep her family intact. She can choose to tolerate it or turn a blind eye to the various bad behaviors of her husband. But if her husband touches her daughter, she will never tolerate it and will fight back. So it is the mother gets abused, which is also the wife. And um, if it's gonna make you feel a little bit sad or you, you know, discretion is advised, but I am very grateful that I got a chance to play this drama role. It's a short film. And now I understand how actors are. They have to put themselves in that situation. They have to put themselves in that moment. They have to be there to play the role. And um, I appreciate for Christina giving me the chance to be in it. So I did have some photos of myself in the past. She let me, she told me it's okay to put it on YouTube. So that's why I'm saying discretion advice. I don't know if YouTube will <laughs> take it off, but there's nothing real, there's nothing, it's not a horror movie. It's a drama movie. But at the end, and you know, and the makeup, the, the, the makeup was done very well is, you know, I, I think it's gonna be fine. <laughs> but um, it's about 15 minutes and it's a short film. And I hope you enjoy it. I hope you really look at it and, um, I just wanted to show you what I do when I'm not doing YouTube and when I'm not working as a beauty advisor, I also like to act. I do that as well. So it's called Mother. It's about 15 minutes and it's a short film and it's a drama. Please enjoy. And I'll talk to you guys later. I will see you guys next week because my husband is taking me out next week because I just... I'm 62. My birthday was August 17th. So yeah, still doing strong and still hanging in there and still working out and feeling great. And to me, 62 is just a number. But next week, I'll take you with me because we're going to take a little trip. Anyways, please enjoy the film and I will see you guys next week. Bye. She is coming back. You promised me. Please, I can put up with anything. But I just don't want Helen to see this. What the fuck are you talking about? You can put up with anything. Did I hear you wrong earlier? I am not cheating on you. We grew up together. 
and he just called me to say hi. You lying, fucking gold digger. You'll run it the first chance you get. But guess what? With me, this shit's forever. Even if I die, you'll be right by my side. I'm sorry. I won't. But I hope when she's back we can. a little cold, so. But it's hot today. Mom, I'm not a kid anymore. guitar. What? It's just eighty dollars. <laughs> just eighty dollars. Let me ask you something. Do you make money now? Do you know how fucking hard it is to make money? Honey, it's okay for the girls to learn something. Shut up! Learn something for what? So she can hang out with some other stupid fucking kids? I'm full. Useless. Can I come in? Yeah. You want a long guitar? I'll buy it for you. It wasn't really about the guitar. I just wanted to see if he still loved me. Honey, you know he loves you. Really? Because I think he'd rather drink beer. Helen. You need to understand him. He is your father. Understand. I understand he's 43 years old and can't take care of himself. He just hasn't been the same since Grandma and Grandpa died. Sometimes he's under a lot of pressure. And I don't want you to be without a father. For you or for me? I really don't get you. Stop treating me like a baby. I'm 17 and I'm not stupid. I guess I'm just wondering if it even hurts anymore. What? You're still trying to hide? Why do you have all that makeup in your bathroom? I just want... Can we talk for a minute? <laughs> Please don't do this in front of her. What do you mean? I mean, you are her father. At least you have to show that you are her father. Seriously? I worked so hard to take care of you two. Yes, but it's been three years.
So now this is my fault. They stole the station from me. My family worked so hard to build that up, and just like that, they took it from me. Do you need this? What are you doing with that necklace? You want a guitar? You shouldn't sell the necklace that grandmother left for you. you like this and you still stay with him you have a choice mom you can just leave what about your father he made his choices that's his responsibility your father and we can't give up on him. Yeah. This medicine isn't going to heal your wounds.
What is that? Give it to me. Did you use my money to buy that? No. My mom gave me this. <laughs> That's funny. Why is it the first time I'm seeing it? Give it to me. I'm not going to say it this twice. This is for Helen. Give it to me! No, you can't have it! No! No! no. Do you want no. this? No! Stop! Enough! Stop. Give it to me. No. I'm begging you, no. leave this loser. It's mine and it's for Helen. What did you say to me? I said you're a loser and I don't want to have a dad like you. Mom. <laughs> no. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Come. Everything. <sighs> I need you. Give me this. Get my purse. Thank you.